What's up, YouTube? Zachary Michaels here. I'm an actor, and this is An Actor Reacts. Today, we'll be reacting to You Still Think of Me, the latest single from Jordan Sparks. Let's get into it. Before we get started, if you're new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment below. You Still Think of Me by Jordan Sparks was released on February 3rd, 2021, the same day she was revealed as the exotic bird on The Masked Dancer. The track was produced by Schmarks, mixed by Joshua Flores, and written by Lisa Go, Savvy, Schmarks, and Jordan Sparks. The song was initially for Lisa Go and was titled I Still Think of You until Jordan added her own experiences to the track. The music video for You Still Think of Me was directed by Sean Alexander and released on February 19th, 2021. Okay, Jordan, You Still Think of Me. Jordan, her latest release, continuing her like rapid release of music and videos and stuff since she like started releasing back at the beginning of 2021. Again, love that for her. Uh, I'm excited to get into this track. I've been meaning to react to it since it uh, first came out back in February 3rd. Um, but I just kept not getting around to it. But then I woke up this morning and saw that the music video was released. And I was like, okay, this I definitely have to react to it now. Um, I'm just excited, again, to get into more Jordan. Like I said, back, way back in like my Reds and Green reaction. Been a fan of Jordan since I was like 11 years old, I think. Um, love her. Love, again, that she's releasing music so rapidly now because it, it was a big gap in time where she hadn't released anything. And love, like, she's doing TV shows and stuff now. I didn't watch The Masked Dancer, but, you know, I watched some clips after I found out it was her. But just love her just, you know, pursuing her career again. She's got a nice, happy home life and stuff now. Uh, but anyway, I'm just kind of rambling now. So let's get into the You Still Think of Me music video. Like the piano. Painting my nails on a shade of blue, shaking my head at the memory of you. Can't believe all of the things you put me through. You had so many outside relations, trying to lie through your teeth, can't explain them. Makes me feel good to just erase them. I like the visual, the colors, or lack thereof. But you still thought of me. You still thought of me. And I know it didn't kill you, baby. You still thought of me. Oh. You still thought of me. I like how minimal and, and empty the instrumental is. She looks beautiful. I unwrap my heart to someone new, leaving you, making it me. It's true. Me, girl, smother them with false attention. Blame is your favorite vocation. It made you feel good till you replaced them. You should try and practice what you preach, but you still think of me. Love this part. Hey, you been a wine. Or roll, I guess. Mm. Feel so raw. Hey. She looks beautiful. You should try and practice what you preach. I still wonder how the hell you sleep. After finally leaving you, I 
see my face when you're asleep I'm inside your head playing games while you use a band-aid of different names oh that's slick while you use a band-aid of different names Nice. I like that. Let's get into my final thoughts. You still think of me. I really, really, really like this track. Love the video. Shout out to Jordan. She really did her thing with this one. Um, but, you know, I'm, I'm already a fan, so I'm practically going to love most things that she puts out. But I really liked this track. Um, where do I start? Um, I loved how simple it, it felt, at least to start off, like it just had the piano and maybe some light drums and it was just really, it felt really raw and emotional and her voice like singing about how, how just kind of bad this relationship was and you know how hard it is for her to, how hard it was for her to kind of move on and, and you feel that rawness in, in the instrumental and just how light it is and then her voice is real light and like sounds kind of slightly broken I guess in the beginning and then you get to to the chorus and you know it, it kind of flips it's like you know it was hard for me to get over you but I you know I've moved on and now I know you still think of me when you when you're dreaming and this and that and that so I loved I love kind of how raw it started out and then the transition into the chorus when you get a little bit more instrumentation and it's like the kind of kind of felt like Arabic tropical mix, like the do 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 and the kind of like drums and stuff that kicked in and like she started like doing like little rolls and uh whines and stuff. So I thought I loved how it picked up with the chorus. I think the chorus was for sure my favorite part of the song. Um, the dude, just again, just that the vibe of it, it just felt real like, oh, you know, this is a ballad, but you can also like aid to it, you know? So I really loved the chorus section. Um, and then I really also loved the lyrical content of the song. Cause like I said, she's singing about how like broken she was and how hard it was for her to move on. And then she's like, and then it, it, it you, you think it's going to be this kind of depressing ballad almost when it first starts off. But then it switches into like, you still think of me though, like I've moved on and you, but you're still hurt. Like you're trying to put a bandaid of different names um, over over this scar, but like it's not working. So I, I love the kind of cockiness on it, that kind of switch in the song. And I think that was like Jordan's um, input on the song. Like I said at the beginning, like, you know, like I was hurting, but now I've moved on. And now you're the one that stuck with those feelings, even though, even like you did the wrong in the relationship and you messed it up, but now I've moved on and you're stuck with all those feelings and you're thinking about me and you're dreaming and you know the I again love that band aid line about like you know band aid uh, band aids of different names like you sleeping with all these women now, but like it's never gonna compare to me. So I love that kind of cockiness and the way the song kind of switches up. Love the production, especially the, when we when we get to the chorus section and the do 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 do. I don't know, maybe that was a harp or a, like a sitar. I don't know quite what that was, but I really like that section. Um, now the on, my only like small gripe was like once we get into that first chorus and it like switches up into the do 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 do, and it's a little more vibey. I wasn't the biggest fan of like pulling the production back again to go back to that raw feeling for the second verse. Like, I get it musically, like, the different sections, but I wish we could have, like, once the, like, more of the production kicked in, I wish we could have kept amping and amping, amping up until the end and not pulled it back for that second verse. Uh, but other than that, I really like the song, especially, like, again, that chorus. That's for sure my favorite section. Love just how raw and vulnerable it feels at the beginning. Um, in the like journey of the song other than the dip out in that second verse but really good uh, song and then love 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 the video it, it was a nice simple it was just her and a bunch of silhouettes I loved how the the color grading was like a little more gray and a little more faded out um she looked beautiful uh, again very simple music video but it definitely conveyed that raw feeling of the song and then you got her whining a little bit in the roles and stuff in the video really beautiful song love the production love the lyrics and 
the kind of how raw it starts out and then it gets into the more kind of cocky territory love the music video the like the colors in it just the different images she looked beautiful uh yeah i think that's all i got on you still think of me really great track um you know excited for more to come hopefully she continues on this role releasing new music and videos and stuff uh yeah i again i've said the feel like i say this every jordan reaction but i'm just happy to see her happy again and releasing music um and i saw on twitter her husband was saying a song like sexin or something and like people not even ready for that so i'm ready i'm excited to see uh you know what else she's got up her sleeve especially with that title you know jordan getting a little nasty which she has done before uh but yeah i think that's all i got on you still think of me really good track uh so leave a comment below let me know your thoughts on this song and music video um are you excited to see what's to come next from jordan what do you think of this track uh, let me know any other recommendations you have from Jordan or any other artists. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends and family, and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Thanks for stopping by. See y'all next time.